got my power coming to this switch here from the positive side of the battery. I fed it through to here from the from the battery. Then I come out the other side and went up in here and there's the red wire here. That goes to my uh, power for my controller for the heat demon it is. Handle grip warmer and um, throttle warmer. So I can end up Killing this power when I turn the key for the ignition on, I can kill a power to kill a power to my heat demon by flicking the switch down. It's off now, no power, even when the key's on for the quad. So when I turn the key on for the quad, I turn this on. Okay, got power to my heat demon. Go over here. And I'll just pause this for a second. Right now I got um, the switch on back here. This here. Uh, show you. I got. Um, Got the toggle switch on is when it's up it's on the on position. I got my ignition turned on. I got full power now going up to uh, the harness to the controller. So I took my test light, I got grounded out. The controller's turned off. But it gets warm even when it's turned off. I can feel my hand on controller and it's it's around about a hundred degrees, 110 maybe Fahrenheit. I can feel the heat right here. And um, I got power. That's the red coming in for power to the harness. This is the harness that come with a kit. I got juice to there. Now with that controller turned off. I shouldn't be getting any warmth um, to this here uh, handle grip on this side here, this harness. I'm, I, can, I can feel the heat, it's about 110 degrees on this here right handle grip now. And there's juice going, with a controller turned off here, there's juice coming up, coming through there. There's the light that goes to the handle grip. There shouldn't be anything there coming from the controller because the controllers are shut off. But I'm still getting juice. And that's why that handle grip is um, warming up right now. I haven't got the left side connected. You know, for, for to go over here. So it's really got me stumped. There must be something wrong with the controller. It must be defective. Anyways, I'll shut her down. Like I said, I'm getting juice on my ground here that goes to my thumb warmer. You can see it's very dim on the ground and on the juice it's, it's it lights up bright the light. But in my knowledge on a ground wire you shouldn't be getting any resistance through it.